it's been a while since I recorded one of these and also since it's been sunny in Ireland. Welcome to the picnic vlog with one picnic mat, one host, one topic and one lovely audience, you guys. And yes, I've been kind of busy. I'm one of the official coaches for Park Champs too and that means I need to make sure all these gamers and streamers will be as good as they can be at chess before the competition begins that is on August the 21st so I have plenty of coaching sessions these weeks live on stream on Twitch as well as I'm trying to upload those clips to YouTube in case you cannot catch them live. I'm really excited about the event and it's great to see all of these creators with all sorts of different backgrounds and channels being so passionate about chess and wanting to improve so I'm gonna try my best and help them but also I want to make sure that from time to time I can still film a picnic vlog so today we're gonna be discussing a very deep topic I've been just thinking that the first episodes have covered quite many serious topics so today here's another one for you food food is one of the best things in the world we need it we like it we like talking about it at least me i'm a foodie i always end up talking about food on most of my live streams too chocoholic fruitaholic does that make any sense but also i love all sorts of different cuisines and because there are so many nice ways you can talk about food i decided to flip the coin and today discuss some of the nightmares you might have come across in your life regarding eating. Now Kevin and I love pizza. We talk about pizza. Choose between Subway, ice cream and pizza. Pizza, 100%. What type of pizza? Yes. <laughs> we consume pizza in videos. Traditional places. Yeah. But unfortunately I don't have footage of the one thing I want to tell you guys about today and that's one of the worst pizzas I've ever had. We're gonna go back in time to 2005. I was competing in Chisinau, Moldova at the European Championship for women. I'm gonna put up a map so that everyone knows where Chisinau is because I must admit that before traveling to Moldova I wasn't quite sure about the geographic location myself. Chisinau is a lovely place. I was pleasantly surprised. They have two official languages in Moldova, Russian and Romanian, and everyone was really friendly in the city. I had a very pleasant time there, except for the one time I decided to order a Hawaiian pizza in an Italian restaurant. Now, I know what you think, pineapple on pizza, I'm one of those people that 85% of the times I would say that's a crime. But then there comes this other 15 or maybe just 10% of uh, my life when I really crave some kind of a sweet flavor on pizza. So sometimes, rarely, I do order Hawaiian pizza. And that day in Moldova, 15 years ago, was one of those days. There I am in an Italian restaurant waiting for my lovely Hawaiian pizza. Already feeling the pineapple flavor mixing with the ham in my mouth. And then the waiter comes, puts down my dish. I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, I've never in my life seen anything like this. The pizza did have pineapples on it. It also had ham. Everything seemed normal except for the fact that they used instead of tomato sauce, cocoa powder an ant is visiting me so let me let me just gently push him away from my arm i love animals but not necessarily when they're crawling up on my arm that was a bit ticklish so back to the dough it has cocoa powder on it all over and not just that it was cocoa powder instead of tomato sauce the cocoa powder was burnt onto the pizza I wish I had a picture of it, but I think you can kind of see how it looked and not just how it looked, but how it tasted. I consider myself not a picky person. I would eat almost anything when I'm hungry, but this dish with the cocoa powder burnt onto the dough and then the ham and pineapple on top of the burnt cocoa, 
I ate a few bites and then had to leave the dish there. I don't really like to complain in restaurants. It's my fault uh, that I ordered something that's prepared differently in Moldova or maybe I was just unlucky. But uh, yes, I couldn't finish my pizza. And ever since I have nightmares about the lovely Hawaiian pizza, Moldova style. But since the picnic vlogs are about the discussion, now I'm throwing the topic to you. What is a dish that you had in a restaurant or prepared at home that turned out a bit differently from how it was supposed to be? Share with me and the community a food nightmare of yours. I can't wait to see your comments and thank you so much for watching my picnic vlogs. I'll be back as soon as I can with more episodes but in the meantime please do enjoy the Pak Chems coaching sessions and the rest of the live streams I'm doing over at Twitch five days a week. That is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday and Sunday and I'm trying my best to upload on YouTube every second day. That's my new goal cross fingers I can keep up because I feel like I'm getting sleep deprived at this stage but I really want to make sure my channel too on YouTube keeps growing thanks to all of you who are interested in my content who are supporting it if you like what I do please consider to subscribe and leave a like on this video as well as remember what I already asked for I need to know about your worst dish ever share with us your food nightmare see you guys soon Bye for now. Oh my.